guys welcome back to my channel if you're new go ahead and click that subscribe button right now and like this video if you aren't new welcome back to another video with kira dior so today i'll be doing a review on the butter lace unit 19 in the color hazelnut um it looks like the last one i did but honestly, y'all, I was not feeling this wig. I've been holding this video back for some weeks now. But since I haven't posted in almost eight months, I was just like, you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and post it because I'm not going to like every wig I purchase. So let's get into it. Also, I will be posting a where I've been video on my vlogs by Kira channel. It will be up top and also down below in the description. So make sure you guys go ahead and subscribe. It'll probably be posted by the end of this week because I have been gone for a full eight months, y'all. But I'm back. So without further ado, let's get into this wig. So now I'm just about to go in with my Eben Tenant Lace Spray in the color Medium Dark. And I'm about to spray that on my cap and also on the wig. And I'm just going to blow dry it because um when this spray comes out it's wet and it tends to smudge if you just apply the wig with it like that so i dry out the spray by blow drying it just to avoid that if that makes sense so here i'm just applying the wig and it is very much giving scalp Honestly, this is not the part that threw me off where I didn't like the wig anymore. Um, I actually loved it right here, okay, because it's giving. So right here, I'm just cutting it in sections so I can better glue it down, of course. So here I'm just applying my Ghost Bond wig glue and I only applied one layer because I wasn't planning on wearing this wig for too long so a second layer was not needed. And I'm just about to blow dry this until it gets tacky. So now I'm about to go in with my Eben adhesive spray just on top of that. And let me tell y'all, that was my first mistake. The black can of Eben adhesive spray is so strong. That wig is not coming off. When it was time to take it off, I couldn't even pull it up. I was pulling my skin as well. Y'all, please be careful with the black can. <laughs> I don't know what they put in that can. No cap. So 
So now I'm just cutting the lace off and as you can see the even tinted lace spray um, blended it with my skin really nice. Only thing is I already had on makeup so you can see my makeup kind of smudging because of the um, adhesive spray I sprayed on top. Um, but yeah, other than that, it's okay. And the big pieces of lace that I wasn't able to cut at the time, I did go back off of camera and um, was able to lift those up and cut those off as well. um so yeah right here i was about to do me some baby hairs but then i was like you know what i think it's better off without any so i just proceeded to um tone down the curls with the mousse okay so now i'm about to go in with my rapid mousse and this is where i instantly hated the wig so it got so thin after I used the mousse, not because of shedding, it's just because y'all know when you use the mousse, it tones down the curls a little bit and gives it a wet look. And I just feel like I should have just left, left it how it was. I did not like this after that. It's like once the mousse dried up, the wig became thin, see-through, like it was horrible. And I'm like, damn, this wig was so nice in the beginning, and the mousse fucked it up. I tried washing it. It would not help this motherfucker. I was just over it. This is me cutting some, like, so it doesn't go straight down. So just cutting it a little bit in the front. And I did that to the other side as well. Like, it doesn't look bad on camera, y'all, but in person after i used the mousse it was horrible and i was so fucking pissed because i actually liked this wig before i did that i didn't even want to record no more y'all know it's bad when you don't want to record no more next i'm just about to go in with my la pro girl concealer in the color fun it really wasn't needed but i just did it as an extra step all in all i rate this wig a six out of ten um so yeah comment um any other wigs you guys want me to review thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe bye guys